हेलो व्यूअर्स वॉर्म वेलकम इन दिस यूट्यूब चैनल क्वेश्चन इज फाइंड द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ एवरेज एक्सेलरेशन बिटवीन द पॉइंट पी एंड क्यू फॉर ए पार्टिकल परफॉर्मिंग यूनिफॉर्म सर्कुलर मोशन रेडियस ऑफ सर्कल इज टू मीटर हियर रेडियस ऑफ सर्कल आर इज गिवन सो आर इज टू मीटर एंड स्पीड इज ऑल्सो गिविन विच इज बी फोर मीटर पर सेकेंड स्टूडेंट द स्पीड इज रोटेटेड एन एंगल हियर स्पीड रोटेट्स एन एंगल थीटा इक्वल टू सिक्सटी देयर फोर चेंज इन वेलोसिटी ड्यू टू डायरेक्शन चेंज so this will be del v equal to 2v sin theta y2 if a particle changes its position from p to q on a circular path with angle theta then its velocity changes to v sin theta y2 or its resultant velocity will be 2v cos theta y2 by using vector addition method so this is the velocity change we find it is here b is given to 4 sin theta is 60 by 2 so this is 8 sin 60 by 2 sin 30 so this is 8 into 1 by 2 that is 4 meter per second okay so this is the change in velocity now time taken to rotate this angle angle is given to 60 so time equal to 2 pi r upon b this is the total time or time of revolution or we can say this is a time period or time taken to cover one cir uh, one circumference 2 pi r upon b since it is covering a partial portion which is theta upon 360 so time taken to cover this part which is make theta equal to 60 degree t equal to 2 pi r r is 2 upon b is 4 theta is 60 this is 360 so 2 2 ja 4 4 cancel 60 1 by 60 6 times so this is pi by 6 or we write pi value 22 o over 7 into 6 so, so this is 11 upon 7 3 are 21 second so time is this therefore question is asking average acceleration average acceleration so this is del v over t change in velocity upon time change in velocity is 4 upon time is 11 upon 21 so this is 4 into 21 upon 11 21 4 84 upon 11 meter per second square because this is acceleration so finally we got the value 84 upon 11 which is given in option a so option a is correct i hope you got it please like the video subscribe the channel thanks for watching